Hey guys, it is Christy K and I am back with a video. This is like a wig revamp video. This is one of my first wigs that I ever bought and I revamped it and I made it into this. So if you want to see how I went from this to this, keep watching. This is something different. For me, I'm revamping a wig. This is probably the very first, yes, yeah, the first wig I ever bought. It's a love me wig. Um, I got a little bit of use out of it, but it was too big. It wasn't until this year that I realized that if you take these two straps in the back of your wig and cross them, it'll make it tighter. And I had a little head, so it was just to slide back. This is before I knew how to do glue. So my little like wig grip would be showing. I'll be looking like a hot ass mess. I have finally tapped into that hack, but I have so many wigs now, I feel like I want to kind of revamp it so that's where this new little series comes in revamping some of my favorite wigs starting with this one so let me slide this on come about these glasses honestly it's not giving much right now it's not i'm gonna enter a photo of what this used to look like because right now it's not giving but it used to be cute but what i want to do is I want to create some bangs all right so it's lined up from ear to ear the first mistake that i made when cutting my wigs it's another mistake i made let me cut them off because those are thick and bulky and they stick up full corners actually maybe i'll hold off on that i don't know where the scissors are also i got a wig head let me use it hello i've graduated to a wig head so i don't to use what i got to make this a lot easier for me make her taller it's a lot quicker to like curl your hair and do your hair on a wig stand for sure. I curled my hair one time and I burned my face. I have learned some things during my wig journey. Let me show you. So I'm gonna let this hot comb heat up, but I'm gonna perfect my middle part because I used to not like middle parts because I felt like they made my head look big, but I'm so over it at this point. Let's perfect that. And then I'll take me a little wax stick. Boom, it's hot yet. It's still warming up, but it's hot enough for me to just get into this part right here. That's all I want. This part, I'm low key finna brush this out, kind of breeze through it. I'm gonna lightly go over it with the comb, but I'm gonna wave it. Like, I, I've never liked straight hair. This is never gonna be a thing for me. So, this is just helping make sure this thing is still on. Bring it down a little bit so I can see, because I'm a little bit. <laughs> all right. So, now that we have established. And actually that middle part is not all the middle part in the way that I wanted to. But it's fine though anyway, I guess, because we're gonna cut bangs. So I'm gonna take this right here, pull that forward, the front. Definitely not enough for a bang. Start small because I can always add, but I can't take it back. So let's see. I probably need scissors to cut bangs, Jesus. I don't got two things to go together. I'm gonna take this and press it to the front. I'm gonna add some wax, press it down, send it to the front. Okay, I'm gonna start here. I feel like I should put it on. I don't know. Actually, I'm gonna do that. Press it down, out the way. I don't know how long it needs to be for my face, but I wanna make sure it's enough. Okay, so now that I'm looking at it, I feel like I need more hair, but I didn't wanna like do more, too, too much hair at first. It's gonna be weird, but I'm here now. I feel like cousin did, I can't see shit. All right. Same thing on this side, we're gonna take a little bit more. Turn on these flat irons. And I'm just gonna go over what I have, like with the comb. Like whatever is banged now, I don't wanna press it forward. I'm gonna do it like that, kinda to give it like a little. <laughs> All right, this wig stressing me out, y'all. Like I thought, felt like I had a center part. I do, there's the center. But then I feel like I have more hair right here this way and then that way. Then when I try to do it, I'm running into the track. But over the, like, I don't know. And I already cut it already here now so i don't know what to do maybe i'll just cut some more in the front my scissor happy ass i'm supposed to like twist i definitely don't want to pass my nose so cut there ah, that's what the fuck is that i'll be saying everybody did a twist and cut you know what for me sis for me this twist and cut is not given but i'm trying to see what i'm working with before i start cutting again bro I fucking look like cousin nap i like this length right here i feel like this good maybe we'll just have like more layers over there but I do need it to be even though. Who gave me these fucking scissors in this idea? Okay, I'm gonna take this off. I'm gonna put on a wig head. I'm gonna do my thing with it. And I'm gonna I'm come back and I'm gonna see. Cause like right now it's not stressing me out. But yeah, if I cut it shorter, it's gonna be slightly shorter. I want it that much shorter. I don't know, gotta lay it on the wig head. So what's happening too is my hair is in this bun in the back. 
so it's not flat because I was lazy about this but I don't want it to reflect this a little little project it's literally stressing me out it's gonna be easy with this real quick a little two for one because I think I'm gonna have like some side bangs so I'm just gonna like take those back Okay y'all, so I'm back, curled the wig, but I guess I'm gonna curl these bangs. I feel like I need a bigger curling iron and I feel like some of these curls didn't curl. So maybe I should hit a few more. I've moved to the wand, I've graduated you guys. It's just easier and I'm just literally just grabbing whatever. But I feel like if I cut it, I'm gonna cut it. I feel like if I cut it, it's gonna be too short. But it's a wig, it's an oldie. Let me pull the wig back where I like my wigs to sit. It's an oldie and if I cut too much, then fuck it. I didn't fuck up a new wig. Alright, let's see. Some of it I cut too much, so I just tried to like brush it back, but I don't know. Oh, this is what we got honestly yeah it looks better than did when i started if you cut bangs in a wig before let me know what i'm missing if y'all got some suggestions for me let me know because i kind of want to do this to a curly wig but if you guys want to keep up with this journey my wigs and me transitioning them make sure that you're subscribed to my channel so that way you don't miss out at first you saw what i did i wasn't quite feeling it i didn't have a lot of time so i took some time i put some tlc into this wig and i absolutely love it yeah, i got so many compliments on this thing because it was popping and i like it and she even has a new nickname but if you guys have any idea of any other wigs you've seen me in that you want me to revamp let me know thank you guys so much for watching if you're not subscribed go ahead and make sure you hit that subscribe button until then i will see you in my next video Mwah.